Frank is your next speaker. He's completing project number three, Get to the Point. The, sp the speech objective is to ensure the beginning, body, and conclusion reinforce the purpose, project sincerity and conviction, and control your nervousness, like Michael ever shows nervousness, and strive not to use notes. Michael Brandt is the CEO of Drive Traffic Media, marketing for social media to CEO to SEO, helping business owners streamline their marketing. Email, email is something we all use, and today he will be helping us to use it to make more money. Email is money in the bank, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> Michael Brandt is the social media man. <laughs> Thank you so much. So are we excited today Yay. about getting emails in your inbox, right? Yeah, no. <laughs> Everybody. No. That incredible product that we all have. Everybody has an email nowadays uh, from a little kid. Today we'll be going over some topics about how incredible this can be used for your business, why everybody needs to have it, and why it is still one of the best medias out there. Everybody talks about social media. Very exciting, right? Facebook, LinkedIn, YouTube. It's right here. It's email. It's on your phone. Everybody has it. So first, what is email marketing? Well, email marketing is a form of direct ma ma marketing which is used for means of promoting your business, your service, your product, putting out promotion. It's great for branding. This is how people remember you. It's very important. Top three email misconceptions. This is huge. Most people think that email marketing isn't effective anymore. It just goes to spam folders. This is a huge misconception. We'll be going into that. Email marketing is about <laughs> spamming people. Anybody feel like that sometimes when they go to their folder? Oh yeah. <laughs> this is why we have a spam folder, an email, a spam email, and this is why we have our regular business email, and then we have one for family possibly. Multiple emails is the key to creating your spam. Email is dead and social media is king now. This is a huge misconception, which I mentioned in the brief overview. Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter is very powerful, but email is still number one, and we'll go into that. Email is old. It's as old as me. 1971. Ray, this is Ray, still alive, awesome guy. He was the first person to do an email. Incredible. Great guy. So the last 40 years, it's still the number one conversion rate. Here's why. According to Direct Marketing Association, 2011, $40 for each dollar spent. That's amazing, right? Would you spend a dollar to make $40? Anyone here? I don't think she wants to make $40 for a dollar. That's all right. <coughs> <laughs> okay. you'll, you'll get it next time. You'll make a dollar for a dollar. <laughs> Five ways to use email. This will help you crush your competitors. This will make you better than everyone else. The autoresponder. Does anybody know what an autoresponder is? Everyone's had one for them. They've, everyone's filled out something, and all of a sudden you get what you wanted in the mail, right? You put in that information, you're like, I really want the seven tips on making my business better. I want the 10 tips on how to make my makeup more incredible and make myself even more beautiful so uh, your husband attacks you, right? <laughs> so, this is a great way, one of the best ways to put this on. You don't even need a website to do email marketing. Everybody thinks, oh, you gotta have a website, gotta have a website. You do, but you don't even need it. You can put these forms on an email form and send it directly to them. You can put this on Facebook, on LinkedIn. You can have this just hosted on an individual site. Very exciting. These forms are very, very important and have a strategic plan. So if you actually have a product that you're giving, let's say you give the 10 tips on a makeup product, right? Let's say it's the best way to put on lipstick, the 10 steps, you know, the, I watched my girlfriend, she does that. The layer first, and then she puts in the middle. I'm like, that's amazing. That's sexy. Let's just watch that again. Right? So, what would be a good follow up? After you teach them the 10 tips, autoresponder, half off your first lipstick order, right? Would, wouldn't you give away 50% on a free product just to get them to order your first order? Easy, right? 
The newsletter. Everybody thinks a newsletter is kind of passe, but it's this is the way to keep in touch with your clients. This is an exciting way to tell them about new products, new, you know, this is a, on apples. Who follows apples here, right? Apples. Well, there are people that follow duct tape making. There are people that follow, you know, birding. I mean, that's got to, my stepbrother did that weird. But this is niched. You get a niche list. This is the power. You don't want a bunch of people that do everything, right? You want a, people that are coming into investing into their future, putting their kids through college and retirement. This is a niche list. You don't want some kid that just graduated high school. Why would you want them on your list, right? Women would be a great list for Mary Kay, right? And what would you be a good list for you? Registered Republicans. Perfect. <laughs> we love them. Another form of showing off in your emails is of the referral. This is perfect. Show people that you had referrals, that people that said how great your business is. Put it right out to them. We miss you. What happens if you don't get an order with Mary Kay or, or another product? You want to send them out a reminder. Hey, we missed you. Where you been? You got to use makeup, right? That's so. <laughs> over. The thank you. It's very important to keep in touch with your clients. If they bought something, send them an automatic thank you. So if you set that up with an e-commerce site or any kind of product, you can bam, bam, you get a thank you. And then also put a thank you and 25% off your next purchase for being a great customer. That's some incentive to buy again right now. So how do we do this? It's so confusing, right? All those things, the, the newsletter, the contact form, the autoresponders, it's so easy. There's so many incredible products out there but which ones to choose? It's very, very confusing to choose the right product. Now, I did the work for you, and too confusing, too expensive, it makes you look cheap. Constant Contact is on TV everywhere, and it is the best product. It has the autoresponders. It has everything you need. It has the newsletters. You pick a format, you build it once, you copy it every time, you change the information. It's so easy. Set it and forget it. Set it, do it two weeks before. It's so great. Well, how do you do this? It's confusing, right? Does everybody say, I'm not going to do this? This is confusing. How am I going to do this? Well, I have an offer. I have two months free <coughs> and constant contact, and I have 1.5 hours of coaching. Now, this is how we get you set up your autoresponders, whatever you want. If we want to do a newsletter, fill it in, have it ready, put it on autopilot, show you how to use it, and you're going to leave going, wow, that was a lot of information, awesome, I'm set up, but then you go to the next month and you say, man, I could use a little refresher. Two calls. So the next two months, call me right before you send out your newsletter. And today, I'm only doing it for $69.00. That's an excellent discount. I'm only doing that today because I'm nuts for giving this price. My <laughs> time is worth a lot more, but I love you guys. So, And you have to book within 30 days. So talk to me after the meeting, and I will be excited to get you on track with your email and make you money in the bank. Thank you. Oh, that was a great speaker. Thank you. <laughs>